That's the Matt Neal line, if anyone asks. Your tyres are cold, watch out. Are they? In my first sim racing video, one of the things I talked about towards the end was getting stuff set up in preparation for VR. And uh, one of the main things to do with that, because what I want to do is minimise having to interact with the keyboard while I've got a headset on, basically. The main thing uh, there that's going to help me is this amazing free app called Crew Chief, which is on version 4 at the moment, um, which can be got. the Here it is just now. Um, it can be had from um, this website here, the Crew Chief. So Crew Chief, the Crew Chief .org, I should say. Um, and all you do is click on that link there and download it and set it up like you would any other uh, app. It's worthwhile just, you know, for your own peace of mind, just, you know, scan it with Windows Defender. Uh, when I scanned it myself, it was fine. But, you know, scan it yourself, make sure that you're happy with it before you install it, obviously. And its purpose basically is to act like a super powered crew chief, like you might get in some racing games. But, but much more than that, it gives you loads of information and it also has speech or voice recognition that's what i've been doing i've had a little bit of trouble with it initially but i think i've got that sorted now what i had to do uh if you have trouble getting voice working what you have to do is go into properties which i just clicked here is an uh, easy way to sort through things is to use this filter and look for audio voice and controllers and what i had to do was enable n audio which is somewhere down here use n audio for playback is here and use n audio for speech recognition if you're having trouble try it default first because it should normally work default without anything uh, extra special on your part uh, but if you are having trouble then click those and magically it'll restart and what you'll get is these drop down menus then you just choose the microphone which is the one i'm using just now and you should just get everything working one other thing that you might need to do because uh, i did have this problem again let's go to audio uh, voice and controllers you may have to do a thing where you tell windows to prefer one uh, voice recognition system over another let's see if i can find it here yes here we go prefer windows speech recognizer and just tick that and and you should be all right there are some other troubleshooting things i had to do so um i'll link this below but um, there is a speech recognition troubleshooting thread by Mr. Bolowski, who is the guy who came up with this and is the, the genius behind most of it, although it's a, apparently a team effort. And follow these instructions. Um, if you are still having trouble, I was having trouble, and I think I've now just fixed it. So I'll just demonstrate here, because you can demonstrate without a game running. So... I'll just start application now you'll hear the default voice which is Jim radio check okay I didn't catch that <laughs> how's my fuel it's fine you got loads car status car looks fine no significant damage Brilliant. So I've just stopped that so he doesn't reply to everything. So I was having trouble. It would, for some reason, it understood how's my fuel. Um, but uh, then when I followed the instructions on that troubleshooting thread, it's understanding all my other requests. Okay, so I did have one more problem. I think because I installed um, it, probably both Crew Chief and R Factor in a different drive, not the C drive, because I need to keep that free for my OS and... Uh, my professional programs, I have a Adobe Creative Cloud subscription, which needs to be the one that runs blisteringly fast. I installed it on my D drive. Now, what that means is that while Crew Chief says that, if you look up here, uh, Crew Chief says that it should 
automatically install the plugins required in R Factor. It didn't, and thankfully they include instructions here as well. I'll link this uh, web page as well in the description. Um, but basically what I had to do was go into Crew Chief. This is my Crew Chief install. Find the plugin uh, directory, R Factor, bin 64, which is actually a directory inside R Factor. And there is the plugin that you need, R Factor 2 Shared Memory Map Plugin 64.dll. So what you would do is copy that and then um, you would copy it over. So this is my R Factor install, which might be somewhere different for you. And um, best way to find out where it is is actually to right click on the game in Steam and you'll find uh, an option to see local files, I think. But what you do is you go into find the R Factor directory, find bin 64, find plugins, and just paste that DLL in there. It wasn't in there when I first looked. So I pasted it in there and it worked, which you can see now. Okay, so I've decided to do a five lap race of my favorite track in the world, Knock Hill. It's a little rough around the edges, this track, and uh, not available on the workshop, um, but it is fabulous to drive. Highly recommend it. Um, and I'm going to be doing this in touring cars. So let's see how he copes with this. I'll be back, uh, right at the back of a 31 or 2 car pack, I think. The track temp is 20 Celsius, B31. Get ready. Go! Too much wheel spin there. The car left. Still there. Still there. Oh, that's a hell of a chunt. He's still there. He's still there. He's still there. Clear left. Yellow flag, sector one. Car left. Still there. Clear left. It looks like Moffat has gone off in the left out of Duffer's dip. Okay, Hi. Mac. You've had a bit of bodywork damage there. I can't believe it even knew to say Duffer's dip. That's fabulous. Left side. He's still there. Hold your line. You're in the middle. Clear right. Clear all around. Let's see if I can take him here. Three twenty-seven. If he. Oh, I can get side. Him. Clear oh, left. Just turn, turn. Wood is now in the lane. Oh. Car left. No. Nope. Clear left. Lost two places. Clear left. Car left. At least I held it. Oh, Normally the back end goes Clear down. left. All right. Concentrate. Left side. Might Still be able there. to get him here. Clear left. Car left. No. Nope. Clear left. Nice one. On your left. Still oh. clear left. Got tags. But he did warn me about it. That was all my fault. So much traffic around here. Let's see if I can get a draft of sorts. That last lap was a 102.40. Sector 1 is. 4.0, car left. Oh, no, You're in the middle. No, clear, no. clear up, car right. You're in the middle. Three will clear, clear all round. No, that wasn't great. That's the Matt Neal line, if anyone asks. Your tyres are cold, watch out. Are they? On 
your right. Hold your line. Oh, I'm on the grass. Left side. Hold your line. You're in the middle. Three wide. Right side's clear. Clear all round. Three wide round the hairpin. Fabulous. Two laps left. We're halfway home. Should be about three. Laps of fuel remaining. That's your oh. fastest lap today. Transparent trainer is confusing me. I'll have to switch left that side. off. Left side. Clear left. If anyone can tell me why it's called a transparent trainer, I'd be grateful because. Still there. Is it just a ghost? Clear left. Left side. He's still there. Still there. I can see him, mate. Still there. Clear left, car left. Still there. Clear left. Car right. He's still there. Still there. Still there. Right, car right. Clear right, B25. Last lap. Okay. That's decent. Two litres left. status. You've got a little bit of bodywork damage there. We think about two laps remaining on this tank. 0 0.7 litres per lap. We're not seeing any significant tyre wear. Take it easy. You've got your front brakes are pretty hot now. Car left. Still there. He's still there. Hold your line. Clear. Car left. Still there. Clear left. Well, that was excellent. So, I hope you can see from that that Crew Chief is amazing. Actually, um, I had some problems with voice recognition, but I think I'm getting there now. So, on your left, clear left. I mean, race is finished, mate, but fine. So, I hope that what you take from this is that you should get Crew Chief left. right now if you're into sim racing. Um, and you should look for the Touring Car mod and Knock Hill as well, because it's fabulous fun. Engage the limiter. Oh. That was fabulous fun. It took me a little bit of getting sorted, but well worth it in the end and now that i've got it sorted it should hopefully just keep working um so thank you for watching stay safe like subscribe and do let me know if you're joining me on this noob sim adventure goodbye